camera to videotape this because I'd like to see this go viral. Video, here we go. This, this is a letter to Christy Clark. Oh yeah. And we're all familiar with Christy. The people of BC want an election to be held as soon as possible. Your cabinet is operating without a mandate from the people. The people of BC have no confidence in your ability to govern in our best interest. You have continually fudged budget forecasts to suit the election cycle. You have bankrupted several crown corporations and stolen monies from others. You have used accounting methods that are questionable and unacceptable. You have lied to the people of BC with every promise for having a timely election to restoring our tax system and providing fiscally responsible economic and environmental leadership. You have eliminated thousands of middle class jobs. You have destroyed our social networks and our public service. You have turned your backs on our judicial system and its dysfunction at the same time you pledged support for Harford's stupid crime bill. And worst of all, you have failed miserably the children of this province who live in poverty. You say families first, but maybe you meant well-connected liberal supporters who donate mostly to the cause families. Evidence on the ground for your joke six-pack crowd, Christy, is that they're out of work because of you. Construction is grounded to a halt in this province as everyone crosses their arms and juts out their chin in defiance of your paralysis on the HST. Bars and restaurants are closing their doors to exhausted and broke to continue fighting a decade of neoliberal policy. Hydro workers are being laid off by the hundreds. On the ground, frontline workers who battle the weather and keep your power on at the beginning of an unpredictable winter. Meter readers were often instrumental to, to providing a safe, uh, a life-saving link in the rural communities. Public health nurses, uh, nurses, for Christ's sakes, Chris, are you out of your freaking mind? How is that family? How is it that family-friendly or job-friendly to ask the frontline health staff who save lives on a regular basis while at the same time you're offering Christmas sugar plums to your bride-made husband? The people of BC won an election now. Campaign on your own money until every child in BC is lifted out of poverty, poverty or until you show us your plan and give us a chance to vote on it, you have no legitimacy in this province to make executive decisions. Call an election, or we the people will call it for you.